Hello everyone. Welcome to Manopatra's Law and Legal News podcast. Let us begin with the news highlights for 10th October. The Honorable Supreme Court while refusing to entertain a plea seeking directions to the central government to declare cow as a national animal has held that it is not the job of the court to decide which matters and also asked which fundamental right of the petitioner was affected. Moving on to the Delhi High Court, the Delhi High Court has set out the various factors that are necessary to be taken into consideration by the appellate authority under the Senior Citizen Act 2007 while dealing with an application seeking stay in a pending appeal against an eviction order. The Delhi High Court has held that it is not open for a court to sue moto question the validity of the registration of a trademark if the same is not disputed or brought in question by the defendant in a suit the delhi high court has directed l'oreal to deposit the principal profited amount after deducting the gst imposed on the net profited amount in six equal installments The Delhi High Court has held that mere fact that authority granting sanction for prosecution under UAPA is located in Delhi will not give the court the jurisdiction to quash the order especially when all ingredients events and proceedings relating to the case are taking place in another jurisdiction. The Kerala High Court while dismissing plea of three retired pilots seeking re-engagement with Air India Express Limited has held that Air India subsidiary is no longer public sector undertaking after privatization and therefore issuance of public law remedy in nature of freight cannot be sought now. The Kerala High Court has held that if man retracts his promise to marry the consensual sex they have had will not constitute rape unless it is established that consent was obtained by him by giving false promises of marriage with no intention of adhering to it. The Jammu Kashmir and Ladakh High Court has held that the disclosure of confidential and sensitive information in the grounds of detention of a person detained under Public Safety Act can be counterproductive to the maintenance of normalcy in the valley. The Gujarat High Court has held that what is important is that the festivals are allowed to be celebrated and it is immaterial under whose banner the same are being celebrated. That is all for today. Thank you and have a great day ahead.